Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And it's match day one in the 2024 UEFA European Championship. It's Romania, and they take on Ukraine. Well, it's vital that you don't have an off day in these group games. Consistency is key to progressing further in the tournament. I'm looking forward to a hard-fought contest here today, Derek. And the starting 11 for Romania. Well, in this 4-5-1, they're packing their midfield, but the two wide players will almost play as out-and-out -out wingers. However, it's important they do get runners from central areas to support the centre-forward. That's going to be key. And the starting 11 for Ukraine. Well, it's the same shape and a fairly similar game plan. It will come down to which set of players show the best form today. And so the match is underway. Sudakov. Konoplia. On the ball, Taras Stepanenko. Viktor Tsigankov. Yorhi Sudakov. Matvienko. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? Well, Derek, he has many attributes, but it's his crossing ability that makes him such an outstanding player. He can bend them in with pace between the goalkeeper and the defenders, stand them up to the far post. Oh, also... opportunity here, Stuart! And the challenge, crisp and clean. Beautifully weighted ball. Now in a more than decent position. On the offensive. Time to play is over. Could be. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. And they will be awarded a free kick for that. comes to absolutely nothing
Well, he could really get at the opposition, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Stanchio. Alibek. Well, it's all about passing as they try to hit the front. Still looking to get the shot off. An alert piece of defending. Yorhi Sudakov. Now Zinchenko. Sudakov. Well, it's a decent looking attack, this. Matvienko. Zinchenko. Who can he pick out? Dragushin. Man. Oh, no stopping him. But really sticking to the task defensively. Alexander Zinchenko. Ilya Zabanyi. Artem Dovbik. Trying to open them up. Oh, might be. Oh, good save. And so it is. The first half story has been written. You might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Stuart. It certainly wasn't his best half of football. He was slightly off the pace, and he gave the ball away too easily at times. But we know he can do much better, so I'm expecting more from him in the second 45. And so the battle commences. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Options in the centre. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. just wasn't going to give that ball away man top class defending Sudakov now Zinchenko that's a good looking ball well that's how to do it inside your own penalty area Nikolai Stanchiu well, doesn't have to do it on his own but timely defending when it mattered and into the last 30 minutes now Stepanenko can they create something from here Stepanenko It did look on for them, but not to be. Stanchiu. It's Marin. Andre Burka. Man. He might be able to profit from the wide position. And putting pay to the danger. Matt 
Matvienko. Artem Dovbik. Well, we can give them high marks for their passing, but can they make this pressure count? But then the one that fails to hit its target. Now, well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. Delightful pass. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. And pressing from the front. Sudakov. Artem Dovbik. Level pegging, but can they change that? teammate available tremendously strong in the tackle Stanchu well the counter chance looks very real well they promised much on the break but ultimately delivered little five minutes left good technique displayed Good idea. Can he put them in front? He does! And with so little time left, that might be the winner. Wonderful drama. Well, here it is again, and the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger, and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. The match has restarted, 1-0 here. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. And that will be all for this game. Romania have lost the match, and that's the big story, Stuart. Well, I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it, conceding so late on. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. Played with real authority and attack, Stuart. Well, he's the match winner, and deservedly so. He was outstanding today. He's great to watch when he's in this sort of form.